There is a surge in gun sales after every mass shooting. Clearly, buyers worry the laws might change. And as Paul Burton shows us tonight, at least one local gun dealer believes they should. People that never thought about owning a gun say, well, you know, I better get one now before I can't get one. Just two days after the deadliest mass shooting in U.S. history, Pullman Arms owner Scott Malkasian says he's been fielding a lot of calls from people interested in buying a gun. And people are afraid of losing their Second Amendment rights, so they want to uh, have the ability to protect themselves and their families, so they come in and they purchase firearms. Attorney General Maura Healy says it's time to reinstitute the federal assault weapons ban. The Orlando shooter Omar Mateen used an AR-50 style rifle. In Massachusetts, we actually banned the sale of, of this particular kind of weapon that was used in Orlando. Six other states have a similar ban, but the federal assault weapons ban lapsed in 2004. And since then, we have seen an exponential rise in the number of mass shootings. After the Colorado mass shooting, Healy sent a letter to all Massachusetts gun dealers, reminding them to obey all gun laws and regulations. And this is about keeping guns out of the hands of people who are a danger to themselves or to others. Scott says authorities need to do a better job screening people before they purchase a gun. The police have to do a better job with, um, with these background checks. Gun control isn't going to stop a terrorist <laughs> from acting out and doing, making his plan. I mean, they took down two of our buildings in, in, in New York State without a single gun being fired. In Worcester, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.